Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. So, uh, coffee. I felt like having swell tea today. Sweet and salty. So I did waffle, butter, syrup, cooked bacon, put it on top. Got a little bit of jam here and blueberries. So this should be good. What am I going to talk about today? I don't know. What happened yesterday? It was a calm day. It snowed. But Bonda picked me up. I took the bus in. Today I think I'll walk home. I'll take the bus and walk home. It's going to be too cold to ride the bike, but warm enough to walk home. So, car wash was dead. Pretty quiet. No one acting stupid, asking stupid questions. No parents. I'm cooking one of them uh, long salmons in the oven because we let it cool, make a salmon sandwich for dinner. Then I'm boiling potatoes. I got green onion. I got the, gray, uh, the grease from the bacon. I'm going to, uh, I'm boiling the potatoes once they're cooked. I'll cut them off and cook them in a frying pan. And put, put some salmon in it to fry them up. Make sure they're cool down really good before I put them in the lunch container. By the time they're, and then at work I get, I buy some sour cream and the uh, lime, so I can have that with the potatoes. Yeah. It's gonna be a fish day. I did have that chicken bacon ranch noodles there at work yesterday. It was good with the broccoli. I just felt like having fish. That's what I'm doing now. Tomorrow I might just do ground beef, take it out tonight. The freezer. Tomorrow I'll fry it up. Put that spaghetti sauce, half the yolkless noodles, have that for supper or for lunch. Supper one at work. Yeah, it's sunny today. It snowed a lot yesterday, but it melts as soon as it hit the ground, like the pain, so.
potatoes and the salmon. It's the little potatoes. I could mush them up, but I'll just cut them up. With a ton of little potatoes anyway, so. You don't peel them. Pretty good. I like a bacon toasted jam sandwich, so I just didn't put jam on the waffles, but the blueberry waffle and the blueberry jam. I'm blueberry yogurt. Oh, blueberry. It wasn't no frills that I found that E.D. Smith jam. I love they don't have it at Walmart anymore. Might have been Safeway or something. I just thought it was E.D. or Walmart had E.D. Smith. Wasn't handling that product or something like that. I know I've seen it somewhere. for sure it was co-op or not co-op but no frills could have seen it at co-op it was a while back so I don't know I've been just going to no frills I go there and get Ian to pick now this weekend I won't have to, I'm just picking up a few things. I'll just bring my the carry-on bag there. The bag on wheels, or I don't know what you call it, but Bacon is so nice. Right. I can usually eat two waffles. I used to have a big appetite, but we're going to find out when he gets older. He's going to find out. Dad's side of the family that I can eat. Big, big, big eaters. Hay fever. The grass is dying, right? Or it's already dead. It's 
coming to life or whatever. But it gets hot like this weekend and it gets really cold again. It'd be good if it kills off those stupid dandelions. It's not yellow flower, it's when it turns white. That pollen kills me. So if it gets hot enough and they grow and then it freezes overnight. They'll die. Because they're so hard to kill those dossy dandelions. I put the acid, we got acid washed off work. Supervisor wanted the dandelions gone. So they clean her. You see that acid wash in there? We'll get rid of them. Kept on pulling them and doing everything to them. He wanted. He wanted them gone so bad, why didn't he go and pour some stuff over them? Out there for them and everything. So we'll get rid of them. They didn't go back last year. They come back this year, we'll put some more of that stuff. Say, okay. Okay. We don't have that many. It's only around fire, uh, fire hydrant and not like we're covered with them. Anyhow, some things you just foolish. I don't agree with, but. Potatoes and that pit should be cooked here soon. That was a pretty good breakfast. After I go to work and do my class and I don't have my my sandwich and then I'll have my supper around six o'clock. Six thirty. Let me check on the <coughs> potatoes. Like this, I can turn them off. No, gotta cook a little bit more. I am not salmon. I took the salmon off, so that's been cooking. I want it to cool down in order to make that ham and salmon. Let the potatoes cook a little bit more. Fry them up with, in a frying pan, put a little bit of, well I'm doing a green onion and salt and pepper bacon grease, the potatoes, and then put the salmon in it. I got dill pickle I can chop up and bring that aside, not put it in it, but, but I got that sour cream that worked too. We dip the potatoes in with the lime. I would let it cool down. I 
I don't want it to fall apart. It gets tougher as it cools down. I cooked it on a cookie sheet, but I put tin foil, so I'll just transfer it over to the board. Something about activity. 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 Don't like the other yogurts. Probably right full of sugar. That's fine. No fat. Must be high in. Anyways, so take that salmon out, upload my video, let the potatoes cook, so that when you put, I don't want it too cooked, but I don't want it, that when you put a knife, it slides down, cut it. I'm going to fry it. And I don't want it both breaking up in the pan too much, you know. So I think they're bad. I can shut them off. So, you guys all have a good day. And see you tomorrow morning. And it's dinner time.